Welcome back to the channel guys, hope everyone's doing well. Today I'm here with my converted box trailer in the background and I thought I'd try and play radio from here. So it's kind of like a proof of concept, so you know when I eventually go mobile with this thing, maybe camping, I'll be able to play some radio from here. Alright, let's go into the wall. So this is a fairly small six foot long Tickner box trailer and I've converted it all out myself, I've panelled it, I've insulated it, um, I've put solar on here as well, so we've got a solar panel on the roof. It's all controlled by this Victron colour control panel. We've got lights, we've got heating as well. This is an infrared heating panel, 180 watts. Surprisingly good and effective in this small space. That's controlled by this little thermostat here. There's a 330 panel on the roof at the moment. It's not really putting in much power because um, it's like a really dark autumnal day. There's two systems in here. There's a 12 volt inverter behind there with a, with a 12 volt 20 amp hour lithium battery for kind of ancillary stuff from the LED lighting. And then to run the heating, the power sockets and anything high power you want to plug into this thing, I've got a 3000 watt 74 volt um, inverter. And that's all in this box. So there's the inverter. And then we've got a 72 volt 35 amp hour battery there and a couple of wing mirrors for some reason. And there's the Panasonic 330 HIT panel. So just having a listen on here. This is channel 19. UK guys, not Channel 19 USA. I've had a lot of people say that's not Channel 19. It is in the UK and we're on FM, not AM. So quite a simple setup here. I've got an FT891 Yaesu. The antenna is just a dipole on the top of this pole. It's not up as high as I could get it because I didn't bring enough coax with me. And to fix it to the size of the trailer, I've got one of these heavy duty suction cup double mounts with a uh, pole adapter on it. This comes like this, I'll put a link in the description to that, it's really good. Oh, I don't know if I mentioned, I've got a proper window in here as well. I'm running the radio off of uh, my Tesla battery, which I've built, um, so it doesn't, you know, obviously take too much power from the from the trailer. And I've got a monitor up here, which can also be used as a TV. I've got a hell of a noise coming in here. Yeah, there's a lot of noise up here. This is not a great location, really. What I really need to do is go on a bit of a mission with this trailer take it up a mountain or something well i've just lost about an hour talking to the local boys so i'm gonna uh, i'm gonna pack up now got this nice little go box for the ft891 fits perfectly in there love these portable setups just so easy to just get up and going and then pack up when you're done so when the outside light kind of drops i've got it set to uh, turn on all the led lights so i've got marker lights around the edge and then this crazy um, sort of door light at the front these have actually discolored a bit i might have to replace those at some point so that's a quick tour of the trailer guys, what do you reckon? It took quite a while to do, I've never done a project like that before, I'm not that great at kind of carpentry either, but I surprised myself actually. I managed to get all the panelling done and the window in and all that stuff so I could actually get onto the bit that I really enjoy which is messing around with all the electrical bits, so with the solar install and all the wiring. So there's still a couple of bits to do on the trailer, I haven't tested it out yet, I haven't taken it anywhere and, and camped out in it, but it would be really cool to go on a mission somewhere and go somewhere really high and play radio maybe like Lake District, Peak District or you know up north somewhere where that weirdo Ringway Manchester lives. Only joking Lewis, I've got him to thank for getting me back into doing radio videos so yeah it's all down to him. So it seems like we've either tapped into a new audience and or you know maybe the the loyal viewers out there um, you want to see more videos about radio so I'm going to carry on doing um, more, there's plenty more to cover on this subject and maybe some kind of more intro videos as well about how to get into this um, hobby. So that's it for this one. Thanks for watching. If you've got any questions about the trailer, leave them down below. Let me know what your thoughts are on the trailer, what could be done to improve it. And um, yeah, we'll catch you in the next one.